Andrea. Um, this is my first video, but I wanted to do my very first Birchbox unboxing. Woo! don't know why you saw my address. It's fun. Um, yeah, so basically, first of all, I want to apologize for my appearance. Um, I just took a shower. I came from the gym. Um, I didn't work out. I just went to the gym because they have nice showers there. and that's You didn't need to know that. Um, I don't know why I said that. I'm so sorry. But, um, yeah, I finally got my birch box, and it was in the mail for, I don't know, a month, three weeks, something like that. It took a really, really long time to get here, and um, I'm not really pleased with that. Um, just because of my lo location, because um, I'm in Hawaii, but um, I also live sometimes in Washington, and it's taken the same amount of time to get there, so I don't know if that's just everybody's case or whatever, but... Um, it's here now. So, um, whoop, there it is. Um, I'm going to share the magic with you. Um, I haven't opened it, but I have never done a bur an uh, unboxing before. Um, I got my Ipsy bag a couple weeks ago, and I really liked that. So now I'm going to do Birchbox. And sorry, my hair is floofy. It's, uh, it's hot because I'm in Hawaii. And there are fans going because my dorm does not have air conditioning because that's logic at work. So, um... Ah, let's get started with this. Um, so I'm going to open it. I'm opening it right now. You can't see it, but you just have to take my word for it that I'm opening it. And I think, I think I went... Yeah. Got it. Sorry, it's taking a while. Alright. So... We're getting it. We're getting it. <laughs> okay. So, here we go. Birchbox, Brie Design. As we do always, sorry. I have Brie. Just ate some Brie, so it's in my teeth now. Alright. So, box. Ooh, I'm not bad. Alright. So, here's the box. Cool geometric design, it looks so three dimensional. And I'm gonna open it. And there's the contents. There's the card. It says what's in it. So I'm not gonna look at that right now because I wanna be surprised. Yeah, surprises. Oh, look at this little kind words of encouragement from Birch Birchbox. It's so pretty, Birchbox. Thank you. I am the best. Alright. Fresh paint, it looks like, is the theme for this month. Fresh paint. Alright. Well, hopefully nothing smells like fresh paint. Um, Alright. So, we also have a chapstick thing. It says fines. It looks like it's a contest. I'm going to look at that later. Alright. And then pink wrapping. Alright, so open that up. Let's see what we got. Okay, so chapstick. Nice. Chapstick here. So I think um, anti aging formula. Yeah, I, that's exactly what I need because apparently I already look too old. Um, moisture and renew. It's actually really, really great because I need chapstick. I have no chopsticks, so this is, that's good. Non-tinted. I hope it smells good, because I like ones that smell good. And I gotta taste, even, well, I mean, you don't, it's, you don't taste it. I mean, you can taste, can you put, never mind. Move on. Alright. Um, we got Toka. Is that how you say it? I'm not, I don't know fancy brands, I'm sorry. Um, EDP. Sorry, what was that? Toka EDP. Eau de Parfum. Um, it's kind of like a green color. You can see that. Um, let's smell it. See what it smells like. It's a roll-on, but you probably already knew that. Oh, no, it's not. I'm just kidding. Um, it's a spray. Perfume spray. I smell like work, so I can't... Spread it in my eye. It's very smart of me. 
It smells pretty good. It's like a normal perfume, and the wrapper is green, not the perfume itself. I don't know why I thought the perfume was green. I'm not the sharpest knife in the drawer or the brightest crayon in the box. Um, apparently, I'm as green as this perfume because I don't. No. All right, moving on. All right. Eyeliner, I'm guessing. I don't know the brand Noir. Noir. Beautiful. Um, I'm presuming it's an eyeliner. And I keep running out of black eyeliner, so that's good. It's nice and smooth. Woo! So, yeah. I like that one. Keeper. And what is this? Pers Rip mint mask for minimalist. Black charcoal sheet mask. Which is actually pretty great for Halloween because you can exfoliate your face as well as scare the crap out of everyone walking down the street. So, let's put this one right here. I'm guessing it looks black. I'm not going to open it right now because I don't need to use this right now because I just took a shower at the gym that I did not work out at. Okay, and then we have the little case here. I haven't gotten any food lately. I really, I really miss getting food. Um, I kind of hope there's food in this one. All right, Suki Exfoliate Foaming Cleanser. Did you put it on the wrong side, didn't you? That. All right. Let's see. Yeah, this smells like citrus, like a lemon. Ooh. Ooh, it's like a scrub. Ooh, it's like a scrub. Okay, I don't have a scrub. You can't see that, but... Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, I'm excited. I'm excited for this one. Alright, what else is in here? <sighs> no food. Instead, I got UB Moisturizing Skin Cream in this handy dandy little package. I don't know if you can see that, but, um, it's a moisturizing... Um, see if I can open it. Gosh, this is... Yeah, so, so sorry. I'm sure we're better at this. Okay. The little baby little tube. It looks like... Uh, ooh! Drop it on my keyboard. It looks as though it's Japanese. The Japanese brand, I believe. You can see that? You probably can't see that, but it's Japanese writing. Um, Hitadrol Hydration from Japan. There's a little scanner. Scan your phone. I'm not even going to bother pointing at it anymore. Okay. So it looks like it's just a moisturizer. It's already open, so I'm going to just... It kind of smells... It kind of smells like, uh... I don't know what that smell is. Um, like aloe vera? Like when you when you have like a, a sinus infection or something and you put the uh, thing underneath your nose to clear your sinuses, it smells like that. So I don't know what that smells. It means aloe vera. I don't know. I don't know. But it's a moisturizer. It goes on really smooth. Um, I still have the stuff from the scrub. But that's that's what I got in my birch box. So to refresh, I got a UV moisturizing cream, which smells like a both inhaler, like a I cannot think, but yeah. Maybe the next, I guess, and then um, Halloween poor minimalist exfoliation mask. Okay, it's not exfoliation. Sheet mask. Poor minimalist. Yeah, well, you know what it is. Took a not green perfume, but actually perfume color. I'm just a moron. Black eyeliner from Noir, which is night which is very appropriate since it's black. Body scrub, which I'm very excited for. It smells delicious. I want to eat it, but I'm not. I'm not that done. And chapstick. The uh, do double-sided uh, thing that I can't get the box. Sorry, you just had me pick my nose. It's one of these... I'm trying to open this so you can all... Ha! <laughs> Got it. All right. And they can use the eyeliner to poke it. Or wait, oh, I have my scissors stuff. Bear with me. I'm so sorry. I'm usually not. It's okay, that's a lie. I'm the Um, alright. Okay. Huh. 
it? Got it. Alright. So here's the chapstick. Um. Alright. So. It does not have a scent. Darn. Um, I think this is the moisturizing side, and this is the other side. Renew. No, this is the moisturize. This is the renew. Gosh, I should not do these last minute. Okay. Oh, this one. The moisturized side smells weird. I don't really know what it smells like, but it smells weird. But I'm so excited to use it. And it's actually labeled. It says renew and moisturize. Huh. Andrea, please learn to read. All right. So that's my birch box. Um, if you got anything different or, um, you know, you don't want any of your stuff or, you know, just leave a comment or whatever, post something. I'm excited to watch everyone else's unboxing videos. Um, that's my first one. Um, hopefully you enjoyed it and hopefully it wasn't too painful to watch. I apologize. Hopefully my next one won't be this bad. Um, I really should probably practice more before I do it. But yeah, um, I'm actually pretty okay with this month's Birchbox. This is Birchbox lately has not been um, good for me. I haven't been liking their products. Um, I much preferred Ipsy to this one, but um, this month's been it's pretty cool. Though I still haven't gotten my food, and that's very very upsetting to me. Um, they keep sending me anti-aging products, which I don't need since I already look way younger than I actually am, and if I put it on the anti-aging stuff, I feel like I'm going to look like I'm 12. Um, but other than that, you know, I haven't been too sad. I think it also takes forever for it to get to me. Um, I don't know if it takes forever to get to everyone else or if it's just the West Coast. It takes forever to get to, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how it works. But, um, yeah, this month is, is, I give it a B. B plus because no food. Hopefully there'll be food next time and I'll give it an A. But um, yeah, good job Birchbox. Um, I'm keeping you with another month. Trippy. All right. Have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you next month for Ipsy and Birchbox one more time. Okay. Bye.